Today I'll be opening a $1,500 Charizard mystery box. I am so excited to show you all what's inside. All right, everybody, I am just gonna dive right in. I am so excited. Should I look inside? Ooh, let me take a little peek. Okay, to start, we just got a little Charizard tin. Nice way to uh, start this mystery box off. Oh, I should have brought something, hold on. I came prepared just in case there were some sealed products in here. I don't really know what to expect in here. Hopefully there's some singles, um, some sealed products, a little bit of everything. That, that's what I'm hoping for. But let's see, starting kind of light over here with the nice Charizard mini tin. I like that. I think, what is this, Crown Zenith? Yeah, Crown Zenith in here. We got some stickers and a couple Crown Zenith. Crown Zenith set has just been unbelievable. I love Crown Zenith set. It's just, the hit rates are so good. The Galarian gal uh, gallery is just beautiful. Let's see if we can get some luck to start. Let's see, let's see what we got. Ponyard, Cricketon. We got a nice little reverse right here. And Caesar. Nothing, 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 nothing. Huh? But that's why they come with two packs. I think it's like a 48% hit rate, so. The luck is forever in our odds that we'll get something in this pack. Let's see what we can get here. Oh, okay. Radiant Charger Bug. I love the Radiant Hollows. Look at those Radiant Hollows. Absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Just a Snorlax. Nothing too crazy. But this box is a uh, $1,500. Imagine if it was a $1,500 box. It has some like first edition Charizard or something crazy in there. So I'm not too worried about it. Okay. Pokemon Celebrations. That's a fun thing to open. I have actually never opened Pokemon Celebrations in my whole life. In my whole life. I started this channel after Pokemon Celebrations came out. And I've uh, never opened Pokemon Celebrations before. So I'm actually really excited to do this. What do we have in here? The Charizard V promo. Very cool. That's a really nice promo. I like that promo a lot. I think there's six, either four or six, I think. Yeah, it looks like one, two, three, four, five, six. Six and two other packs. We'll save these two for later. And for later, I mean like three minutes <laughs> once I finish opening these, but I'm way too excited for these celebrations packs since I've never opened it before. I know there's, is it a, what's the gallery? There's some type of gallery. Um, it's like the, the old school gallery. They got like the OG cards in here. I think it would have been right there in that third slot if we were to get something. Um, but I'm just so excited. They have like Shining Magikarp. Um, there's Charizard. We could pull the Charizard. We could pull any of the three starters in this. That's gonna be amazing. Imagine if we can pull um, one of the three starters. Obviously we want, ooh, a Gardevoir EX. Very nice. Let's see if it, does it say, no, it doesn't really say what the collection is, but that, that's what that collection is. It's so cool. Ooh, and a Zamazenta V. Sweet. Yeah, I wish I, I wish I could remember what it is, but look, I'll look it up. Maybe I'll post like an image of, uh, of what it is on the screen. Wow, we've gotten one of these in every single pack. One of these uh, uh, Cosmons. Ooh, nice. Nice. Imp uh, Imposter Professor Oak. Ooh, and a Professor's Research. A little matchy-matchy in this set, huh? A little matchy-matchy. All right. It, it's so cool how there's only four cards, so you get so many packs to open. Love opening all the packs. Now I'm just fiending for a Charizard over here, though. Imagine if we can pull that Charizard or a Blastoise. I've never had a first edition um, Blastoise Charizard or uh, Venusaur, so this uh, obviously it's not first edition, but it'll scratch the itch a little bit for uh, for some of them. Nothing really too crazy so far from these. Ooh, that's a cool Zagrom. Love the foil on that. So cool right there. Dialga, Palkia, and the Mew. Nice. Love that Mew. Love that Mew. Yeah, this uh, this box, it's it's nothing too crazy right now, although I think this uh, this Celebration Sin, uh, that's probably pretty valuable. I don't know if it's up to 100 bucks, but it's probably between like 60 to 80 is my guess. The Luga is sweet, look at that Luga. Probably like 60 to 80 is is my guess. Nice, see Sean V. Celebrations is, is getting pretty pretty. Oh, that was the last one already? We flew through those packs so fast. I, I'm, just, I'm just way too excited. <laughs> I'm going too fast with these packs. All right, let's see. So cool that it comes with some miscellaneous things too. What do we got here, anything good? Oop, skipped it. That could be a good sign. Oop, I see something. Okay, full Canyon V. Nothing too, oop, sorry, I almost forgot the code, 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 I can't speak. The code card 
for you code carters out there. Gotta make sure I'm giving them to you. Gotta make sure I'm giving them to you. All right, let's see what we can get here. Is this Darkness of Blaze? What was this? Darkness of Blaze. So we got more Charizards in here. More Charizards for us to pull. All right, what we got? What we got? What we got? What we got? We got the Trapinch. Okay, it's front. Okay. Ooh, I like that a lot. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. That's okay. That was a fun 10. I don't think we really got anything too crazy, but it was a fun 10. It was a fun 10. All right. What else do we have over here? I don't want to look because I don't want to like ruin the surprise. Okay. Uh, oh, there's like, I think there's like an order. I think there's an order of, I don't know if there's an order. I'm just picking up the things that are stacked on top of each other. So hopefully it didn't like all bounce. Ooh, ooh, we have, I think we have more tins in here. Hold on. Another tin. <laughs> oh, a Charizard. Is this Kanto? I want to say it's like a Kanto region tin. Two of them. Okay. Well, that's fun. I think that's, yeah, it's like a Kanto region Charizard tin, I want to say these are. What packs are in these? These are going to be fun. I wonder what packs are in these. We got two. That's exciting. All right, let's see. I hear the coin in there. Oh, I thought I heard. Yeah, there it is. All right, what do we got? What do we got? I, maybe we have some older packs in here. Let's see what the coin looks like. The smaller coin. Nice. Looks like a uh, nine tails right there. That's a nice little coin. We have, of course, the Charizard. Ooh, Sun and Moon. And X and Y. If we can get this thing out. I have follows you up. I'm trying not to damage the card. Don't yell at me, please. Oh, I, I have to open this X and Y. I can't not open the X and Y. Come on. I can't not open the X and Y. What we got in here? All right. Wow, this is so exciting. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Oh, ho, ho. that's a sick Entei. Look at that. Love Entei. Very cool. I'm not really sure, uh, like, the values on these things. I, I don't really know what's going on with this card, to be honest. It's sweet. I don't know if it's too valuable, but such a cool-looking card. That's for sure. All right. Yeah, I haven't opened too many of these sets. This, these are the sets that they're not ridiculously expensive, so I want to buy more of them, obviously, but they're still pretty pricey. They're still absolutely pretty pricey. All right, let's see. This is more of what I'm used to. We know we got the, the reverse, and then behind it, just a Starmie non-hollow. But we got another one. We got another one. So our luck can uh, get a little bit better. I wish I knew more about that set to know if that Entei was any good. I'm, uh, I'm putting the, I of course put the prices on the screen, so you'll all know by now uh, if it was any good. I have a feeling it wasn't really anything too, too crazy. Look at these tins. If you're a sealed collector, as you watch me open everything <laughs> immediately, that's a cool tin to kind of just keep, I think. That's a pretty cool tin. See if it's the same the same uh, coin. I do like collecting the coins as well. Yeah, same coin. Super cool coin. Let's see if it is the same. Same right there. Let's see if we got the same packs inside. I'm not sure how they did with the tins. If they're the same, different. Um, let's see. We have the Ancient Origins and the Sun and Moon. We'll do the uh, Sun and Moon first. This time, switch it up a little bit. All right, what can we get here? Ooh, it's a cool little Pikachu art. One thing, when you don't open all the older sets, it's, it's cool to see all the art styles. You know, even if you don't get anything, like, look at that hollow foil on there. So cool, that hollow foil. Okay, a hollow. Nothing, uh, nothing too crazy, though. Maybe we can get something crazy from here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. These tins gotta be, yeah. I, I wonder if these tins, whoa. Maybe it's, this is just an alternate for these. Somebody let me know in the comments what, uh, what these are. Maybe that's just a common card. <laughs> I was going like crazy for that Ente over there. There's a little common card. Porygon, and behind it, the Gudra. Yeah, so no, like, no crazy pulls so far, really. Nothing really. Let's see uh, what else we got. Like I said, I'm just kind of going in order. Ooh, okay. This one's a lot thinner. Definitely no tins in here. We have some singles. Yep. Yeah. I can, I guess we can go in the order, right? I was gonna flip around backwards, but now I think about it, we'll go in the order. To start off, the Pokemon Go Charizard. Not really a crazy one, but still pretty cool. Okay, the Radiant Charizard. I am obsessed with these. I, I know I already said it. Ooh, hope nobody peeked. I am like obsessed. Check out that foil on there, the Radiance. The Radiant foil is just beautiful. I had to bring my light over to show everybody because it's just way too nice. Look at that. <clears throat> I know the Radiants aren't like the craziest valuable cards out there or anything, but the foil is just absolutely incredible. 
absolutely amazing. So nothing really too crazy there either. Let's see. Okay, Charizard EX. I think this is just the Obsidian Flames. This is the first Charizard I've ever pulled since I was a child. So this means something to me. This, this Charizard EX. The very first Charizard I've ever pulled since I was like 10 or seven or whatever it is. <laughs> no way. And I see a card peeking through. I think I know what it is. I'm gonna try to hide it. But look at this card right here. Oh my gosh. That is such a nice card right there. Wow, but I'm I'm even more excited for the card behind it. But before, I'm gonna flip this over because I saw the top of it. I know I think I, I think I know what it is. I wanna look at this card a little bit. Wow, this is a nice card. And it looks like it's in pretty good condition too. Maybe a little beat up over here, but that is an incredible card. This has gotta be like a hundred dollar card right here. What are we? Oh. It's a little beat up on the back. There's a decent amount of whitening we have over here, so not really in the best condition, but that is such a cool card right there. Wow. I've never seen this in person before. Oh my gosh. All right, I think I saw, I, I saw the top peeking through of this card. Let's see if it was in good condition on the back. It looks like it. I think these are just kind of some dust particles. Oh, I'm so excited for this. I think I know what it is. Let's see if I was right. Yep. The Charizard B. <laughs> Look at that foil too. Incredible foil. Oh my gosh. That is absolutely amazing. Unbelievable. Whew. All right, well, we're starting to get our value, it looks like. <laughs> I mean, that had to be $250 of Charizards right there. All right, what do we have next? It feels like we have another tin. Okay. Hidden Fates. Hidden Fates Charizard tin. I feel like Hidden Fates absolutely blew up and then it kind of slowed down a little bit. I feel like it's uh, come down a decent amount um, in price, but I'm sure this tin wasn't cheap. Let's check out this, uh, let's check out this promo. See what it's looking like, see what we're working with on this promo. And we can take a take a look at the packs. That's a super cool promo. Oh, I didn't even notice the, the little fire right there. Such a cool, I, I miss the GXs. I don't know about you all, but I miss the GXs. The GXs were such cool cards. I, I want them to bring the GXs back. I hope we can pull some GX out of here. That, you know what, that, that's my goal right now. Let's pull a GX. Let's see if we can pull a GX. Because I love the GXs. Let's see, Ekans, Caterpie, Paris. Nice, that's a cool Charmander, look at that. The Clefairy, love these foils, by the way. Look at those. The Jolteon, non-hollow. Jolteon, non-hollow, nothing, uh, nothing crazy there, but we have, what, three more packs to rip of Hidden Fates? I think there was only one thing left. Only one thing left in there. Um, I mean, I was just feeling around. That's pretty cool. A little hollow energy. I don't know why, the hollow energies are just cool to me. I know like once you get a couple, it kind of like, why do I need a hundred hollow energies? But they're still pretty cool to me. I think they're fun. And at least, it, was that, that was a fire, I think, right? A little matches our Charizard box. They must have, uh, the Charizard gods must have known. Oh, sweet. The baby shiny shuppet. That's a sick, look at that hollow. Beautiful on there. And Brock's training. I'm happy we got that uh, baby baby shiny because the pulls haven't really been that great, but that makes up for it. How fast am I opening these packs? There you go, wow. I am flying through. I thought I, I, thought I had one left, but I'm just absolutely destroying these packs. <laughs> All right, what else we got, what else we got? Ooh, oh, oh, do I see something back there? Nice, look at that, the nice lady. The foils on these are just amazing. Absolutely amazing, absolutely, absolutely amazing. That's really our, our, our biggest hit of the day right here. The biggest hit of the day, well, besides the two sweet Charizard circles. A nice full art right there, very nice full art right there. All right, I think there was one thing left. I just took a peek, I am right. This is the last thing in there. As we can see, we got an empty box. All right, we got one thing left. We got more single. I know what this is. This is a slab. This is a slab and it's got a graded guard on it. A PSA slab. Oh, that is the last thing in the box. That's gotta be something good, right? Oh my gosh, it's gotta be something good. This thing was 1500 bucks for this box. Whew. Are we ready? Before we open this, I just wanna thank everybody for watching. Thank you for getting this far in the video. I appreciate you. If you like videos like this, please consider liking, subscribing, leave a comment for me because it really, really helps. It allows me to do more of these. I plan to do one of these a month. I'm gonna do a mystery box every month with 
a certain Pokemon. So leave me a comment. Let me know what Pokemon you want next. Whatever you want you want. Rayquaza, Mew, Mewtwo, Blastoise, Charmander, whatever you want to do. Just let me know. Leave me a comment. Maybe I'll do like the most comments. I'll have somebody make me a, um, a mystery box for that. And we'll see. Hopefully like at least a thousand bucks or something. Just trying to make some good videos for you all. So thank you again for watching. Let's see what this is. I'm so excited. Are we ready? Are we ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> Dark Charizard, holographic in a PSA 9 first edition. That is incredible. Absolutely incredible. Thanks for watching, everybody.